E.T., you look different than the last time I saw you. <laughs> More Canadian, maybe, right? Yeah. yeah less Thinner head. Thinner head. Smaller eyes. <laughs> a little a, a warmer. Maybe warmer. I don't know. Was, was E.T. cold? Well, I, I don't know. I... Anyway, let's get down to it. Maybe when he started really needing to phone home in the latter stages <laughs> of the story. E. <laughs> oh, what were um, you talking about? E.T., our, our compatriots in the States that do the same thing. Ah. Uh, right now, Steven Spielberg's E.T. The, you're talking about the extraterrestrial, you work for the extraterrestrial media company? <laughs> Sometimes Let's go. Like Let's it. do this Sometimes interview. Like I'm ready. I've just been waiting for you guys to find me. What I really like about you, a number of things, you're so animated on this carpet. I could watch you all night, but the first and foremost, you get out there with your fans. You take pictures. You meet them. You sign things. Why is that so important to you? What's the joy of this whole... I mean, this is why, this is why we do it, to have a um, connection. Okay. You know, yeah. uh, we are as as artists. We seek connection. We try to communicate. Um, and for me, this is a special case yeah. Yeah. Uh, because I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. So this, I don't know. This is like being embraced by your own community more than really a actor to fan dynamic. It is you a know? pretty special, warm welcome from these fans here in Toronto and Canada. Um, how excited is it to to? be embraced uh, into this whole world, this different world that you're not used to, this Harry Potter world. Uh, it's wonderful. I mean, for me, what I'd say is that fans who are devoted to the material are already involved in this world, right? Yeah. Because, because you live the ethos of Harry Potter. You embody the morality, the, these ideas about loving one another and about friendship, about courage. Um, you are already in this world, you know what I mean? You are already in the J.K. Rowling universe if you are a devoted fan. So in some ways, I've been in this universe since I was seven, and uh, now I just get to continue. It's a blessing. It's a so blessing. You get that call. You're going to be in this movie. How does that make you feel? What goes through your mind? Um, uh, it was really... Um, yeah, it was a, a, a very special moment in which I think there was so much joy in my body that I could have burst. Uh, I sort of had a moment of temporary insanity and jubilee on the streets of New York City, uh, got a couple awkward stares, um, and had to evacuate the premises quickly after recovering. <laughs> Can you compare the Justice League fans, the comic book fans, to the Harry Potter fans? I think there's... Um, you find this diehard level of devotion in both places. And I think um, both of these stories are, you know, uh, sort of modern mythologies that people really do use as a, as a source of information and inspiration in the way that they live their lives. You know what I mean? It becomes a huge part of people's realities. And I think it benefits people largely to have, uh, to have fantasy like that, to have story. Um, I think it's really good for us as individuals and collectively as a culture to have these stories that we can all refer to, uh, like, you know, so you can be like, you know, stop being, you're really umbraging me right now, you know, and someone will be like, whoa, that's horrible. I'm so sorry. Because we have a, a, we have a, a vernacular, mutually understood vernacular based on these stories we all know. Um, well, you're being pulled away, but lastly, the, we've got to talk about the tights. And it's, it's hard for you, I, I'm assuming, to get away from the tights of the Flash. You just live in them. You love them. You're comfortable. Yeah, once I, you know... Once I fa once you find tights, there's there's really there's really no going back because your legs are just swaddled like wee babes in blankets. It's so aerodynamic. It's true. I mean, it's true. If I uh, fell over, it would happen quicker.